I've talked to, there's been some some tight end movement. Uh, yeah, you, know, you never want to see anybody get hurt or anything like that. But how does that change your role now? It's like you're the oldest guy out there, and you know you're gonna be out there a lot. Uh, yeah, I definitely need to step up, but everybody else below me needs to step up too. It's I mean we're we're a unit, and everybody's gonna be playing, and everybody needs to step up. And Kiel brought a lot of energy to this group, and. It's something we all need to we all need to step up in and bring that same energy he brought. How much does it help that he's still gonna be around in, in a sense? Oh man, it helps a lot. I mean last scrimmage he was on the sideline and every time I caught a ball he'd I mean I can hear him over there cheering. So his, his just his voice, it, it brings a lot of energy to this team and it's something we need on the sideline. So if you guys had to play today in a two tight end set, who'd be out there beside yourself? Uh, we got a bunch of guys that are they can go out there and do it, you know. Uh, it's not really set in stone right now, we're still Still trying to find some guys that can step up and, and fill that void, but everybody's working hard and doing a good job, so we'll see. How's Chandler so, adjusting to it? Uh, he's, he's, he's adjusting. He's, good. he's a great blocker, you know. That's what we need him for. He needs to go in there and he needs to move some people. Um, he's still in the learning phase, learning the new plays and stuff, but he's coming along good. How good is he at catching the ball? Uh, he's, he's caught a few balls from camp, yeah. It's, it's, it's been fun. He caught a touchdown a couple, uh, like a week and a half ago or something, so it was, it was cool to see. It's good for him. What have the freshmen shown you in camp? Obviously, with Keel and whatever happens to Nick, they're obviously going to probably get some playing time this season. Yeah, they're uh, they're both Trey and uh, uh, Keyshawn are both very athletic athletic guys. Um, they've they've come in, they've worked hard, they've gotten stronger in the weight room, um, they've learned the playbook. They both they both know what they're doing out there. So it's just um, they when their numbers called, they're going to need to step up and and help us when they can. Is Keel always? I mean, you talking to him? Is, was coaching always in his future? Yeah, he's always he's always talking about uh, being going back to Georgia and being a high school coach, being a coach somewhere. He he loves football, man, and and he wants to be around it his rest of the life, rest of his life, sure. What will make him a good? What do you think will make him a good, uh, good coach? Yeah, uh, his energy. I mean, he loves football. I mean, he goes out there, he's laughing, he's having fun, he he brings everybody up, and I think he'd be a great coach in that sense. Sorry for already been asked this, but yeah. are you shifting over a little more to that H back role, and who is kind of working at the H back role without Evan and Keel there? Um, yeah, I'm doing a little bit more of what Keel used to do with the split out stuff. Um, I'm doing mostly both. I'm trying to get good at both, but trying to work on that for sure. And then uh, uh, everybody's getting reps. Um, we, we're going to need everybody to step up in the tight end room. Uh, I was going to say, is it a little lonely in the tight end room right now? Uh, yeah, it's. I mean, we're a little banged up right now. But uh, everybody's stepping up. The freshmen are stepping up. We'll register stepping up. So it's just come week one, we're going to see who, who, when the number's called, who can perform and help us win. How much more does this put on those other three guys? Uh, it puts on a lot. Um, Kiel brought a lot of energy, like I said. He was a great player, made a lot of plays. So um, we all need to step up in that sense. How excited are you to now kind of shift sites over to North Carolina and actually begin a, a game week of practice? I'm excited. I'm kind of sick and tired of banging against our own defense. You know, for 19 days we've been just banging heads against each other, so it's going to be good to go against someone else. Thank you. Uh,